Today, we are making a Korean side dish called Mirchi Pokkum. Mirchi Pokkum is stir fried dried anchovies. Mirchi Pokkum's side dish is known for being one of the most nutritious side dishes in Korean cuisine. Yes, Google it to read more about it. Mirchi Pokkum Panchan is made in many variations. Today, we are making Kwari Kochu Mirchi Pokkum. By the way, panchan means side dishes in Korean. 오늘의 밑반찬 recipe, 꽈리 고추 멸치 볶음. 오늘도 여러분들과 영어를 함께 하겠습니다. And guess what? This 멸치 볶음 반찬 is one of the side dishes included in the famous Squid Game drama's lunchbox called 도시락. This 반찬 is called 콩자반, black beans braised in soy sauce, and of course, every Korean's must-have panchan, kimchi. Recipes for the soy sauce, black beans, kongjaban, and kimchi are listed in the description box below. Hi everyone, this is Helen, and welcome to Modern Pepper. 안녕하세요, Modern Pepper의 Helen입니다. These medium-sized dried anchovies are called jung mirchi, and these big guys are called tashi mirchi and these big guys are only for making broth with and we want to use these medium sized ones that are perfect for making stir fry mirchi pokkum. You could also use those tiny tiny little ones as well. These peppers are called kwari gochu, commonly known as shoshito peppers here in the States. So after you rinse your shishito peppers or kwari gochu, just take the stem off like that. Preheat your frying pan on high heat for about a minute. I want you to drizzle some oil, about a good tablespoon, and we're going to add six kwari gochu. On super high heat, we're going to add a pinch of salt and a little bit of black pepper. And let this cook on high heat until we get a little bit of charred mark on it. So just until you get a little bit of blistered mark like that. And then just flip it over. And we're going to add a quarter of a medium onion. And just quickly saute it like this for a good 15 seconds on super high heat. And then we're going to lower our heat to medium. And then we're going to push everything to the side like that. And then we're going to add a tablespoon of oil. And then we're going to add a one cup of medium-sized dried anchovies. And then we're just going to lightly just kind of pan fry it on medium heat. And I want you to know that these guys are salty already, so we don't need to salt our anchovies. And then just lightly saute it for about a good two minutes. As soon as the anchovies turn just slightly brown like that, it's ready. So we're going to push this to the side, like so. I want you to tilt the frying pan a little bit at an angle like that. A tablespoon of water. And then we're going to add half a tablespoon of garlic. Half a tablespoon of brown sugar. Half a tablespoon of soy sauce. All purpose is fine, or chinganjang. So once it starts bubbling over like this, the garlic has cooked, the sugar has cooked, and then we just mix it up like that. And this is basically done. That's how quick and easy it is to make this. Oh, the peppery smell of the peppers is really, really nice and fragrant. So it should taste somewhat salty and just slightly, slightly sweet.
Jan, Jan. <laughs> so why am I wearing a Squid Game uh, Dramas outfit here? Because uh, I like to. No, just kidding. So today's recipe is included in my Squid Game Drama food recipe video where I go over all the foods and recipes that are included in Squid Game Drama. Yes, yes. So do check out that video. It will be included in the description box below and the link is somewhere up here or here. And I will see you in that video. So I wanna thank everyone for watching and if you enjoyed watching today's video, I would greatly, greatly appreciate it if you would click on that thumbs up icon and subscribe if you did not subscribe yet. 여러분 오늘 재밌게 보셨으면 꼭 좋아하는 버튼 눌러주세요. 구독 버튼도 눌러주시고요. 다음 비디오에서 꼭 뵙겠습니다. And I will see you in one of the videos you see right here.